Here in this video, I'm going to talk about when your girlfriend stops messaging you like before, is she ignoring you and is she doing it on purpose? Let's get into an email and we'll talk about this in more detail. Hey Chris, I'm currently dating a girl but we could only meet once. We started messaging on Instagram and everything went really well and we met up after a week or so. We agreed to meet again after a few days but she got really bad news that afternoon so we cancelled the date. The fact is we are both struggling with our thesis and she is really worried especially now that there were some problems with her family too. So anytime you have stress or problems in a relationship, if a girl is feeling stress, generally they will back away from you. That's just the way it goes. But when that happens, you gotta let them back off, give them space, and they will come back to you. If you trust that they will come back, you give them space, you don't panic, you don't freak out. As I learned from your book, Atomic Attraction, being stoic and patient is important. And I think I'm doing a really good job, but as weeks pass by, and I'm done with my thesis, this waiting is getting more and more difficult. Weeks earlier, she messaged me all day, but now without any change in my behavior, she is kind of distant, but when I reach out to her, she's like the same as before, but she's just not reaching out to me at all. So in this case, look, she's busy or she's stressed. She's not reaching out to you as much as she did before. So you notice the change in her behavior. You notice the change in the pattern, and that is what will trigger you because you're gonna to start to think, hey, maybe she's losing interest in me. Maybe she's found someone else. Maybe she's not attracted to me anymore. Whatever the case may be, if she pulls away from you, you have to let her go because that is the way, believe it or not, to spark attraction and to get her reattracted to you. You can't keep on talking to a girl all the time and expect her to have high interest in you. It doesn't work like that. Still, the last two times I was the one who messaged her and I can't help but think that maybe she's losing interest. Although she told me that it's really stressful for her now, but still want to meet up with me later on, is there any chance that I'm overthinking this whole situation? And is there a way to make her more attracted to me? I'm scared that her attraction is fading away. There are times when I feel that this thing between us, especially her initial high attraction for me, will just disappear. Does space and less talk really help maintain attraction? Because I feel that everything will just vanish as days pass by. It's a good question, and this is something I get asked a lot. If you stop messaging a girl, if she pulls away from you, will she lose attraction for you? And will pulling away cause her to lose interest? That's something that a lot of guys can't get their head around, is if she pulls away from you and you pull away from her in response, they think, oh, well, she's just gonna go meet another guy, or she's just gonna lose interest in me, or she's gonna lose attraction, or she's gonna think I'm not interested anymore. That's not what happens. Actually, what happens is they, they start to get more interested in you and she'll start to focus on you and wonder about you even more. I always say, if you have one guy going up to a girl and giving her a thousand roses and love bombing the hell out of her and you have another guy who just simply lays off the messaging, he doesn't do anything, he just goes to the gym, he lives his life, who do you think that woman is going to be more attracted to? She's going to be much more attracted to the man who's not trying to win her over She's going to be much more attracted to the guy who's a challenge. She's going to be much more attracted to the, to the man who is less responsive. So you have to do exactly the same thing in this situation. If you sense that she's pulling away or she's losing attraction for you, yeah, that happens, especially if you're talking all the time on the phone, texting all the time, calling all the time. Women will lose interest in you and they will pull away from you at that point. So you have to be very aware of this. It's not like in the beginning. When you first meet a girl or you're first talking to her, it's really easy to talk on the phone. You can talk for hours, days, but at some point in time, she will lose interest because it gets boring, it gets predictable. She will want to get back to her normal life and her normal routine, and if she feels like all this messaging and calling and texting is just taking her away from her normal life, it's stopping her from doing things that she enjoys, and she's wondering why you're able to spend so much time messaging her, she's also going to wonder, what are you doing with your life? Don't you have anything else better to do? And so when she pulls away from you, you must also pull away. Take the focus off her and let her come to you when she's ready. If you can do that, you won't have any problem maintaining attraction with a woman because it will show that you're on your purpose. She'll feel comfortable and safe coming back to you because she knows you're not going to get upset and she can go away, do her thing, come back when she's ready and everything is fine. You've got great att attraction at that point. So this is one of the important things to understand when it comes to attraction. It's a little bit counterintuitive, 
But when a woman pulls away from you, you don't need to panic. You don't need to feel like she's going to meet someone else. You don't need to feel like she's going to forget about you. In fact, the opposite is true. Now, if you need help with a specific relationship problem, don't forget I do Skype, phone, and email consultations. You can book a consultation with me on my website. And if you want to know more about creating, maintaining, and building attraction, don't forget to check out my book, Atomic Attraction. You can pick up your copy today by going to Amazon.com or clicking on the link below. Talk soon.